at the end of July 2023, I went home from Wales in the United Kingdom, the Great Britain, to Lesotho, which is where I am originally from. And this is me in the bus around 4 a.m. That was the time I boarded the bus. And we traveled through from where I stay and then to Heathrow Airport. I must commend the United Kingdom with the plantation. Like everywhere, there are trees, the reservations are good. I think the global warming here is respected, so I love it. So I used the National Express bus service. It's a good one. It's actually very cheap if you book well ahead of your traveling date. And it's comfortable. And then this is Cardiff. Passing through Cardiff. It's a good city. Then the next one is um, Newport. Whew, Newport is beautiful. It's clean. It's so calm. I've never seen Newport congested. I have never seen a lot of people around here. So I love Newport. If I must move, <laughs> I might consider going to Newport. It's so clean. So this is the bus station where the buses for Newport City are all there there it is yes this is the bus station so in each city there is a um, bus app where you'll be able to track bus times and not miss your bus then we pass in through Newport and after we pass through Newport there is um, a long long bridge that connects that separates Wales from England so it's actually long like very long it's beautiful it's secure it's like there's no traffic there so this is us passing through the bridge that I was talking about earlier it's actually long so i had to fast forward the clip <laughs> so this is the i just forgot the name of the bridge but i would search it out and put it the text of on top here so passing through then i have heard that in future like if the wales welsh government want to separate from england it might be the point where we call it immigration of, um, of Welsh government or England. I don't know. It's just a conspiracy theory. So at this point, I was now in London, uh, entrance of the Heathrow Airport. See, yes, welcome to Heathrow. This is the entrance to Terminal Three and terminal two yes so going through into terminal two and three that's the first stop for national express so that's where i will get off the bus and then go connect my flight was in terminal four so the bus that I took did not go to terminal, terminal 4. I had to disembark and then take the bus to another terminal. So this is me going through terminal 3. And it was a long walk <laughs> through terminal 3 into the subway train that I was going to take to terminal 4. So if you know me, I don't take escalators, especially if I walk alone. I'm afraid of escalators, so I would rather use stairs or walk 
or use the lift so this is the ticket point for the train it's not it's a free train so you have to take a ticket to open the gates so I'm now in the train this train was taking me to terminal 5 because my train to terminal 4 got delayed by 30 minutes so I had to take um, another train to terminal 5 then when I reached terminal 5 I was supposed to take a bus outside to terminal 4 hmm. so if you go in to take a flight just be on time like three four hours before your flight because you don't know what's going to happen that's me there trying to explain but it was too loud so i couldn't use the original sound for the audio like for this clip so this is me in the bus at terminal 5 now taking me to terminal 4 and then this is me at the key for boarding and then going through security check now I am with just one bag I have handed over my checked in bag so I'm going through security here and into the plane this is the plane foyer I don't know if it's called the foyer <laughs> corridor or something going into the plane boarding to fly from Heathrow London to Abu Dhabi International Airport where I will be connecting to OR Tambo International Airport in South Africa so there we go we go it was a long corridor a long curious corridor and then here almost into the plane this is a nice experience i must say so it's just a pt i was traveling alone but it's a nice experience though so we're going through when you enter there are flight attendants at the door they confirm your passport and your boarding pass and when they check they, they are going to check which seat you are going to and then they'll give you a proper direction so now into the plane and then i'm navigating towards my seat ah there we are there we are there we are there we are almost there so there are a little bit different compartments in a plane there is first class there is um, premium there is economy and then economy classic so there are many it depends which part of your ticket so here we are in Abu Dhabi it was hot very hot and imagine I had to run <laughs> For the next flight because the layover was the transfer time was just one hour 30 minutes but it was very far we arrived at terminal 3 and we had to run to terminal 4 so i had to run imagine me running so when we reached the terminal 4 we took a bus from the gate to the plane and so there we are waiting for the direction of the bus driver to go into the plane so we use the stairway to board the plane there we go there we go it was a freaking hot so there we are i went up the stairs up the stairs up 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 the stairs <laughs> And at this point it was starting to cool down a little bit so still in the plane food it was delicious it was a uh, curry whatsoever i can't remember now approaching 
Oar Tambo International Airport in South Africa. That was the next day in the morning. So there we are, almost, 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 almost. This is the scariest past for me. I am afraid of landing than afraid to go up. So I was praying if I was about to release the audio for this clip. <laughs> I was praying, I think, in tongues. <laughs> Anyways, so we approaching Heathrow, not Heathrow, Oar Tambo International Airport, and there we are, there we are, going down. Oh, I was over the moon here because I could see that now I only have four hours left to, until I reach my own country. So now I was starting to be shaky <laughs> because I'm afraid of Lenny. There we are, there we are. Look, 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 look. Touchdown. Oof. Oh my god. It still give, gives me chills. Oh, look at that. Right. Now we arrived in Uwarutambo International Airport in South Africa. So at this point, I'm only left with four hours until I reach my country. So I was going to take a taxi to my country, which is going to be four hours. And then, there we are, out of the plane going to collect my check back and then, no this time I was going to do immigration and then after immigration I'm going to collect my bag my check bag there we are I got my check bag so I have all my luggages with me now I'm going Ooh, look at me in my country oh my god this is it <laughs>